What the fuck, we're in a... What the fuck is this place? Oh my god. What the fuck is some kind of goddamn barracks, man? All I remember is fucking passing out. What the fuck is happening, man? It's fucking... Fucking helicopters, fucking trucks. There's fucking... Barracks? What the fuck? Where the fuck am I? What the fuck is going on? Wow. Am I somewhere where I'm not supposed to be? Fucking hell, man, I'm s I'm just fucking goddamn, what the fuck is going on here? There's buildings of fucking labels and miss- gr Oh, missile. Man, a missile, that's nice. But man, this place is fucking crazy. What the fuck is going on? Where the fuck am I? Man, this place is fucking... What the fuck? Helicopters? Oh, there's someone. Hello? Frank? Is, is that you, Michael? Yeah? What the hell are you doing here? Where the fuck's here? <laughs> How did you get here? Well, you know, fucking, we were out doing something, and uh, we're doing a little stuff, and then we finished the thing, and uh, I walked off. I got mega stoned, and I got high as a kite. Then I was like, "Oh, I saw, I saw, I saw a vehicle like that just parked out on the side of the place." I was like, "Oh, that looks like a nice place to take a snap." So I freaking jumped in the back and just passed the fuck out. And then when I wake Jesus. up, I'm 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 in this place. What the hell is this place? It's, it's the red boy. What looks like really bad place. Where the hell is this place? Uh, What's going on? Uh, this is uh the foundation, and uh you 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 shouldn't be here. You shouldn't know about this. Like hmm. I'm I'm sorry to do this to you, Frank, but do what to me? What are you gonna do? I'm got I I I gotta inject you with this. So um yeah, let me uh stab. <laughs> what was that supposed You're to laughing? do? What's that supposed to do? I feel nothing. What? Yeah, I feel like... Th th those are knee sticks. They're I feel... supposed to make you lose your memory. I felt nothing. I felt absolutely nothing. Wee. <laughs> Hmm. Oh, barracks. Lockers. What are you doing? I don't know. What are you talking about? What, what are you doing in here? I don't know. I was just walking. What do you mean? Okay, but... But seriously, how, how did you not forget? Well, it's probably because how many drugs I've probably taken. That yeah. probably makes sense. The probably amount of all the concoctions of drugs in your system probably somehow counteracted the drug which is amnesic. Oh, that's some good shit. Which which shouldn't be possible because we have tested amnesics on P 
people who have done drugs, but I guess you've done drugs to such a level that it's... <laughs> that... I, I, let me take a quick scan of how much... How many drugs are in your system? Scanning, <laughs> scanning... A hundred and ten percent! How is that even possible? I don't know, you tell me! I've just been doing drugs here for as long as I can remember. And sometimes I went up in weird places. Is... <laughs> the is a hundred percent. The system is not supposed to detect a hundred and ten percent. So the fact that you're a hundred and ten percent is... Wow, um, this definitely complicates things. Hmm. Oh, it's gone again. Hmm? How did I get over here? What the fuck's going on? Oh, command center. <laughs> command center. Frank. What? Um... Would you tell society about this? I just need to ask you that real quickly. Uh, I don't know. I'm too drugged up to do anything. <laughs> I'm hardly ever sober. Yeah. No one probably even believe me. I don't know. <laughs> That's true. But the fact that you're clearly doing anomalous things, uh, how about you join us, Frank? Join us at the Foundation. Oh, join. Hmm. Seems interesting. Let's do this. Alright, well then, uh, you can be, uh, leader of, uh, I guess, uh, drug division since... Woo, drugs! Expert, expert on drugs. Um, uh, <laughs> we didn't even properly have the drug division before. Most drugs just fell under the medical division, but we can start a specific drug division run by you. Well, drugs are my forte. <laughs> Yeah, yes, yes, indeed, um, yeah, so, I, I guess it's a deal, um, what, what hourly pay would you expect? Um, buck fifty. A, a buck fifty for, per hour? Permanent. <laughs> like, what do you mean by permanent? Like, a buck fifty a day, or like a buck fifty, like a buck fifty per minute. Per minute. Yeah. Oh, that's... Uh, let me do a quick, quick crack calculations. That's like... That's like 90 bucks an hour. That's okay. Like, uh, 50 cents per minute, my last uh, offer. Okay, let me just do some quick... 
calculations, that's 30 um, dollars an hour, um, which I will over 24, once I say 20 hours, uh, uh, there's a lot to calculate on. Um, let me do some quick calculations, bring out my calculator. Uh, uh, no, I don't want that on. So 30 bucks for, and that's, so over a day, and then over a year. That's two thousand six hundred. Uh, uh, two thousand. Uh, no, 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 two two hundred thousand. Uh, two hundred sixty-two thousand. I mean, um, uh, and eight hundred dollars per year. Yeah, yeah, this is acceptable, I suppose. You got yourself a deal. All right. Nice. Where's my offices? Um, I guess, uh, you can, uh, just, uh, pick and choose, or do you want a specific office? Where's the drugs hidden? I'll work there. Uh, most drugs would be in the medical bay, then? I will work there. Uh, yeah, so... Yeah, you can work in here. I don't really have much of an office space, unfortunately. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, what's this drug? Oh. <laughs> I believe that may, it may not be more amnestics. It makes me feel funny. <laughs> and that's probably... Uh, that looks like it has the flesh that hates. That's really bad. I seem fine. And next, <laughs> you're you're fine. That is marvel. But then again, I I already cured the flesh that hates. So we really only test with it to see here like what the flesh that hates and is gone. I find myself in the peculiar places sometimes. I've not even known how I got there. Yeah. Well, uh, welcome to the foundation. Um, yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll leave you be to get acquainted. Um, I've just got a, hold um, a meeting. Um, uh, yeah. Okay. So, uh, yeah. Uh, you, you can explore and stuff, um, yeah. What's in the big the chest? And, yeah. Um. Yeah. Uh, I'm going. <laughs> Uh, 
Uh, Hello. Hi, Frank. Yeah? Hello. Hello, my name's um, Frank. Uh, I, I've got a mission <laughs> for you. Yeah, from who? Um, um, from, well, from, it was from a, uh, my captain who then it came from the commander, which originally came from Michael, but yeah, um, the mission is to apparently kill someone. I I don't know. Doesn't nice. seem correct to me, but yeah, you can assign uh, someone like I don't know the the alternate axle if you want. He's he's a guy in like Spartan armor. Oh, it, it should be <laughs> easily recognizable. Hopefully. Okay. Anyway, uh, good luck, uh, Commander Frank. Well, get out of here! Uh, okay, uh, bye. Bye. Huh. <sighs> Hello, I'm looking for uh, Mr. Axel, alternate Axel. Ah, uh, yeah, that's me. Why? Uh, I have a job for you. You're coming with me today. Uh, all right. Who are you? I am Commander Frank. All right. I have been sent on a mission, which I need you to come with me. Okay. We'll be heading out now. Alright. I guess you lead the way. Yep, I just do a dish and... And we're here. Oh, we teleported. Yeah. Uh, the person we're looking for is somewhere in this location. We've been dealt with a task to, uh, we're going to take them out, we're going to, um, you know, uh, we're going to put it into them, we're going to stick them in the ground. Why are we killing Is this that... person exactly? Uh, I came from the higher-ups and I was told to take you and we're supposed to, uh, exterminate them. Let's see, let's see, let's check out this, uh, office first. Um, no receptionist. That's they weird. Some sort of security area. Yeah, it doesn't it doesn't look like it. Maybe maybe somewhere else. What's over here? Oh, a whole bunch of TVs. <laughs> Man, this is gonna be great. Let's have a look here. Um, let's turn oh, on. Oh, these TV. are security. Oh, camera room four, this seems to be empty. Yeah. That one's empty too. Oh, room one, room one, empty. room one. Room one, okay. We gotta go take them out. Okay, uh, get your uh, weapons ready, boy. We're gonna have to go take this person out. Okay. Room one is, is one, two, okay, over there. I haven't known Mike for a long time, but that this doesn't seem like his style. Yeah, mm, okay. Let's, uh... Looks like okay, room you need to kick, over this way. Kick in the door and then... Then, um... Right. Pull out your gun. Alright. <clears throat> Alright. We're coming in! Anyone's here, come out slowly and don't make any sudden moves. I think so, I saw something in the closet. 
You pick with the wrong girl to mess with. Yeah, she. Yeah, you got. Hey. You know what you do, Axe. Yeah, no. You do your job. Hey, stop. Why are you in my hotel room? I don't appreciate intruders in here. Well, apparently, there's been an execution order on you. On me? Well, yes. I'm just a little lady. I didn't do nothing wrong. What could have led to you may, like, being picked up by, like, authorities, like the SCP. SCP? What the hell is that? Dealing with anomalies and oddities. What, do you Does mean that, that alien bullshit? Bells? Just do your job! I breathe your job, do it! Yeah, I'm you do that job and I'll take it down with me. I'm asking questions. Okay, I guess I'll put my freaking hands up. God damn. So, what do you know? I don't know anything, just that you two just decided to bust the door down into this hotel room. But are you the cops? In a way, yes. I don't appreciate busting down my door without any warning. Well, we're kind of above the law. We don't need warrants. I'll just say that's corruption, then. It's for just the safety the of everyone. Well, just state your business. Why in the world do we got an a cop office an astronaut and some kind of weed dick? Um, <laughs> that's Commander weed dick to you. Commander, who the hell let you in charge of that outfit? That's a crime right there. I let all arrest you. I could. I I don't know how as a commander, but. I need to know if you're actually trustworthy or not. Well, how do I know that you're too trustworthy when you just busted down my door? Dirt Having an awfully nice dirt peaceful dirt night here. So you two showed up. I brought you to do a job to stay the Because I'm not going to execute you without a good reason to. So what, you're telling me that you just came out here to execute someone, basically murder? Yeah, which doesn't seem right, but... No hell it ain't! Because that's not usually how we work. I mean, you literally have a weed dick for a commander, so... <laughs> I don't have state do from. Job. Yeah, do that job. Yeah, I do I mean, I always said it earlier. When I feel like doing the job, you're kind of a bad commander. You know, you're, you're not exactly a great commander, Frank. Like, I, I, I literally don't know why we're executing her, so, you know what? <laughs> and handcuffs. You well, are now under arrest. And I'm no longer Axel. Call me Zale. Okay then. Anyway, can you two please gladly get out of my hotel room? 
Oh yeah, I'll, I'll drag him out. I, I, I'm very sorry about this. I'll be glad and call the cops on you two. And I'll come back. Uh, hopefully we won't. Alright, this car should do. And I guess I'll call up my car to come pick up his commander. My car. Pick up your commander. What happened to my commander? You'll find out, Michael. Me personally, I'm leaving. So, yeah. Bye, Michael. Wait. Alright. What's going on? Why did you bring... Frank and Hancock sale. Well, he tried to send me out on a mission to kill someone. Execution, he says. Right. And what happened to your spawn armor? I got rid of it. Okay. Frank, what happened? Well, I was, you know, <laughs> you know, I was like in my office. Then this this guy knocks on my door called, uh, I think his name was like Soldier Leonard. He said to me that he was told by someone who 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 was told by you to, um, go kill someone and take, uh, like at this age, Axel with me, which is no longer his name by the sounds of it. <laughs> To go uh, kill them. I probably did not order this. Um, so, Soldier Leonard, you said. Then, who, who was at the top of the list? Do you know? It was someone. Name? Do you know the name of the commander that? May have been in charge of it. Uh, I, I can't remember. I, I, you know, I, I'm not a hundred percent of the brain, but I think it's that if it's a C or an O. I can't remember. But he said he was told by someone was told, or someone was told, but someone was told to go take this person out, and it was given to me. So, all you know is that. A soldier named Leonard gave you the orders, and you don't even know the commander's name, who originally may have supposed to be handling the mission. Uh, tell you the truth, I it was pretty out of my gourd. I, I don't remember much. <laughs> <sighs> who in specific were you taking care of, like? I was told that there was someone at a at a like a, a motel place that had to be taken out. Motel. That's pretty that much a, narrows it down. Was it? That's all I was told. Female. I think it was female. Okay, that narrows it down. Did you get a name of the target? Only a description. Zayo, did you get a name from them? I did not. I was questioning what she did, and she said she was innocent. She has some kind of revolver gun with a black hat and a black dress. Oh. I, I think I may know who it was then. So that means... That narrows it down to Commander, um, um, I think his name is, uh, uh, Cody, um, because you said started with a C or L, 
and he mm -hmm. is a lazy commander. He is an awful commander. I, I've been wanting to fire him for a while, but haven't had the opportunity to do so. This is finally a perfect opportunity. I'll talk to him later. So then, how Hi, did please. you figure that out through uh, investigating who we tried to kill? Well, originally I gave the mission to him. Like, it was his mission. Once I narrowed down who the target was, like, once I had those details, I figured out, and the location, I figured out it was the mission that I assigned to my commander, Commander Cody. But he must have passed it down in the chain of command until eventually it got to Frank. Then who was the target? Is that some kind of dangerous SCP we should worry about? Um, I think she's fine, probably, but apparently there was something she knew, but it, I, I don't remember the specific details. I mainly needed an investigation for it, but it seems like it ended up turning into a... Uh, uh, assassination somehow. Without me knowing. Is this any part of your fault, Frank? No, I was just told to take someone out and I was told to take someone with me. And if someone was... God damn it, Cody. Yeah, I'm definitely going to have to talk to Cody later. Were you told well, to take care of someone or to take someone out? It uh, was specifically uh, to take care of, not take out. Yeah, that's... That's what I meant, to kill. Take care of, does it mean to kill someone? No. Man, this is really weird. Okay, so this is equally your fault as is Commander Cody for not even doing the mission in the first place. Oh. Man, this light is bright, and I need to smoke. Can I ask, can, can I use my powers? Can I use my powers for my handcuffs? Can I? Fine. I guess you're oh, yes. free. Ah. <sighs> <sighs> we need to unlock the car. He, he's anomalous. I could have gone out whenever I wanted to, but I was safe to stay Hank after I wanted to get in too much trouble. <sighs> well, I guess, uh, Frank, all I can really do is, like, say, next time, be more careful with orders. Make certain the orders are the correct orders. I'll make sure to double check with you next time before I do anything else that requires a killing or assassination or any mission for the future concern that most of my time is spent here not really going out much. I just test all the random drugs you guys send me. <laughs> yep. <laughs> and, and I guess for, back for you say or you were just following orders, so yeah. Um, 
just yeah. and you did the right thing by questioning so uh yeah uh next time if things seem off today or just contact me all right then well i'm going back to my drug testing i'll catch you guys later you're free to go, Zay. I've got contact with Commander Curry. Are you sure it was a good idea to make him a commander? Duh. He's a fake commander. Uh -oh. He did not get the 